hi guys it's day 17 of crochet kitchen cotton today we're gonna do the spread the dishcloth joy spread the dishcloth joy and this pattern is from carefuls c-a-r-f-u-l apostrophe s crochet and it's an easy textured dishcloth pattern from Careful's Crochet. And she has a little story here on the front of how she came up with this pattern. And then the pattern. It could be a dishcloth or a washcloth. Uh, does she have the dimensions? I don't see the dimensions. I think mine ended up being 10 by 10. Okay. And I have to tell you about this yarn I used. Okay. So, she's recommending the Hirschner's Heritage Cotton. I never bought any cotton yarn from Hirschner's. Um, you chain 29 stitches and you use the single crochet, the double crochet. And, yeah, single in one stitch and double in the other and I think some people might call this the lemon pill stitch I don't know I didn't investigate it I just made it <laughs> and of course you can change the size of the dish cost by changing them with more or fewer chains so what I did was I had bought some um, of the ice yarn I think I got a mystery bag from the yarn nut and it turned out that I, and one thing I got was like a donut you guys call it and another one was a skein and this yarn says that it's a hundred percent acrylic and that each one of these were um, 50 grams it doesn't say the color. I don't even see. It's made in Turkey. Made in Turkey. Let's see if there's a number on here. I'm not really seeing a number. But anyway, this yarn, even though it says 100% acrylic, it's very stiff, very scratchy. I mean, it's almost like having. A scrubby dishcloth so what I did because the yarn was real thin oh I didn't bring the extra in here the yarn was real thin I put two strands together so like if you look at this right here that's two strands so you can tell that it's kind was kind of thin and so what I did is I held both skeins together, as you can see, I used both of them, and I made this Share the Joy, Share the Joy, Share the Dishcloth Joy with this. And it came out really nice. It's got a lot of scrub to it, um, and I made a dishcloth. Then I had leftovers, and as you just saw, I made two of these because that's what I'm doing with my leftover yarn. I have enough yarn to make one more, so I'm going to make that. And then I made two coasters. Now these are kind of kind of rough, so you could use them as a scrubby. And I was going to put them together as a scrubby, but it was just kind of too tight, and it was the yarn was dragging on itself. So I, you can use them as coasters. Or as an individual scrubby but this yarn is pretty cool as an acrylic 100% acrylic I don't think I would wear it as a garment so I made it in to kitchen stuff so I will link the spread the dishcloth joy pattern below and I hope that you guys love it I mean I think the color of this is beautiful got like a lilac and then a darker purple sorry it doesn't have the colors on the band either band 
And okay, so this was day 17 of Kitchen Cotton Month. And we're more than halfway through. Please subscribe. Please like. Hugs, hugs to all my subscribers. Love you guys.